Hey, what's going on friends? Blind and Marksman here and today we're going to be using a 180 hand cannon that's been gaining a lot of momentum the last couple of weeks here in the final shape and that's the sightline survey. Now 180 hand cannons isn't a popular archetype in the crucible. Uh, it just takes too long to get the time to kill. Um, it's not very forgiving unless you have sort of damage perks like kill clip. Um, and especially when you have one 120s, 140s, which can outduel it with range and TTK. But what makes Sideline Survey stand out is this precision instrument. Dealing sustained damage significantly increases the precision damage. Now, this perk is popular with hand cannons like Igneous Hammer, which uh, deals bonus damage on headshots and kind of helps with the damage drop off with range. So ideally with this 180, it's going to be able to three tap uh, any resilience guardians if I'm able to hit my uh, crit shots. Add that keep away with, uh, you know, it increases the range and reload speed and accuracy when there's no one within 15 meters. Accurize, ri excuse me, accurize rounds to uh, boost the range and hammer forge also to boost the range. Added up a backup mag to kind of help with the magazine perks. So right now, uh, statistically, Sightline Survey sits at 76 range with keep away active and 83 reload speed with keep away active. So um, sitting pretty well. Hopefully this is be able to compete in the Crucible. I haven't tried it out yet. I'm not a fan of 180s, um, but um, I'm interested to at least try this one. See a, see a higher fears in the crucible. Um, so let's get to it. Your opponents. Friends, 2v2. First game of the day. See how this weapon feels. Not a fan of 180s. Uh, see, with that, that would have been just so easy. Tap. But he, if he didn't heal himself, that would have been a kill. Um, again, it's just something about the just the kick of the gun. I'm not a fan of it. Don't like it at all. Get the goo to proc there. I don't know, position instrument proc there. It's nice. Good jump. Nice job, teammate. Like that guy lag. Interesting. I thought you were challenged. This guy with ace over here in the right. Those are the shots I felt like I was hitting earlier, but 
I don't know, maybe I was hitting off shoulder or something. I mean, I got 3.5, but it definitely did not feel that way. Oh, well, on to the next one. Got my range. And box at 81. Wow. Behind me, Let's just crouch, get out of the radar for a minute. Right. My nib is. Sorry, hate. That was, that was my threat inspector for some reason. <laughs> oh, good spawn in their game. Good spawn. You're in first place. That was all crits. Apparently. That was all crits, right? I feel like that was all crits. Apparently, uh, I didn't three tap in there. Interesting. Oh, that gets me amplified. I don't like being amplified. Wait. Double. I mean, he went for it. So I guess I'll give him credit for that. But I would have just backed out. Nah, is it me? Or is precision instrument not working? Oh, you know what? I got a body shot there. I just. Precision instruments crocking. There we go. It's a big win. I didn't think I was gonna pull that off. I don't know. Again, I, I'm not a fan of this this archetype. It's just something about it. It just feels so off. All right, game in progress. Another rumble match. See, that first shot felt like I got the crit, but you know, apparently I missed. This guy's gonna be floating around there. Right? Is. Makes it a little easier for me to get those kills. I love chaperone for just for that one reason. This has so much better range. Oh, I missed my shot. Oh, this is bad news bears. <laughs> nice. Boy, that guy's just lagging everywhere. Alright, 
video game. Good stuff. Good stuff. Still manage just to like just to pull that off. How you going? This guy has sword. Nice. Not nice. Alright, three tap came in clutch there. Take that. Fight on and claim victory. It's all or nothing. I'll take it. Very unfulfilling win again. <sighs> I'm sorry, I, I, this is coming out so negative, but I'm just not a fan of 180s. Alright friends, uh, well, that was the sideline survey. Just a quick couple of matches. Uh, when I do live comms, I kind of just record my first three games, uh, get an initial reaction to it. When I do a review, I tend to spend a little more time with the weapon. But uh, taking some positive out of the sideline survey, uh, is definitely one of the best 180s I've used. I think the only one that felt good for me was the posterity. Um, but Sightline Survey, I, I definitely feel it was probably one of the better 180s I've used. Uh, Precision Instruments, uh, I think I probably had to look back at the video, but I felt like I was three tapping a couple of Guardians and I was not getting the, 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 the kill. Um, and then there was times where I felt like I was missing and then I was getting the kill. Uh, so I don't know, maybe it's just the inconsistencies. Uh, maybe it's just lag. I know one of the matches I had that Warlock was just teleporting everywhere. Uh, it could be a combination of the two. Um, but when precision, precision instrument was proccing, it was definitely working. Um, definitely tell the nice crips three tap and the TTK was significantly reduced to that 0.67, which feels amazing. Uh, keep away. S tier perk felt very snappy. Um, overall, I think uh, I, I think this is a good weapon. Um, I, I don't think this is by any means something that's going to change the Crucible. Uh, there's obviously better options out there, uh, but for something to kind of just go in and not really care and just play with a gun, I think this would be a, a good one to use. Felt very snappy. Uh, a lot of it. You know, thanks to uh, the exotic class item with Ophidian, Spirit of Ophidians. Uh, so I was definitely able to ignore the handling here. I think um, if you're going to use this hand cannon or any type of 180 hand cannon, handling needs to be uh, a priority for you. Uh, not necessarily in the stats, but probably in the mods that you're going to use. Um, again, overall, fun weapon. Uh, I, I don't think I'm going to use this again. Uh, but it's just something I want to kind of just dip my toes in since it did get a lot of hype within the past week or, or two. Uh, but thanks for watching, friends. I appreciate it. If you feel like, uh, leave a thumbs up if you feel like the video is worth one. Uh, leave a thumbs down uh, if you don't. And friends, enjoy your 4th of July weekend if you're here in the United States. If not, enjoy the rest of your week. All right, till next time. Cheers.